What's up guys, Zcalb here. Today we are bringing you the AMAX. I'm going to be showing you guys my best class setup. But real quick guys, I was looking at my YouTube stats and apparently 76% of you guys aren't subscribed to my YouTube channel. So take this moment right now to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and hit notifications on so you don't miss a video. If you haven't checked out my Warzone class letter for the Amex, definitely check that out. My class setups for Warzone and multiplayer, they're really different. So if you want to check that out, you can go ahead and click up here on the top right or link will be in the description down below. All right, just like how I always do in previous videos, I go into a custom match. So this one right here has zero attachments and as we go on i'm gonna show you how each attachment affects the weapon so let's go ahead and get right to it all right guys so first we're going to start out with my base amex with no attachments nothing really too special the iron sights are my favorite but this is the accuracy so that kicks around a little bit not the most accurate thing and on sight speed is not that bad also so let's go ahead and go to my first attachment my first attachment is going to be the barrel we're gonna have the the xrk zodiac s440 barrel this is gonna add damage range bullet velocity and recoil control with the uh, aim down sight speed and movement speed slightly decreasing so we'll go ahead and go to our second attachment so just like my other guns i like to add the gi mini reflex as my sight just because you have a lot of space to look into when you're aiming down at your opponent so not too much of a difference made with this kind of helps where you recoil but another than the less let's get to our third attachment all right so our third attachment is going to be the no stock this is just going to add the mobility to the weapon adding movement speed and aim down sight speed so it is pretty quick as we aim down our sight and then movement speed just going around with it pretty quick not too bad for an assault rifle so let's go ahead and go to our fourth attachment. So our fourth attachment is going to be the Ranger 4 grip, which is going to have recoil control and aiming stability with aiming, walking movement speed, and aim down sight speed slightly decreased, not too much actually. So it's going to be perfect. So this forward grip is going to be the main key point to our weapon with accuracy wise. So a lot more accurate and more in the red area than around. All right, and then our last attachment, it's gonna be slide of hand, obviously makes you reload faster. So with the AMX personally, just because the max rounds it can have is 45, I don't think an extra 50 rounds is worth it. So might as well just attach slide of hand. And then I also run an ammunition box. Make sure to run tune up with it. That way it recharges 40% faster. But I also have cold blooded and ghost. And then for my lethal, I have a Semtex and my tactical, I have a stim. So check out the stats for the AMX right now. So the accuracy goes up tremendously, the range goes up as well, fire rate increases, mobility slightly increases, and control increases as well. So none of the attachments that I have really affect the AMX in a negative way. So yeah guys, this is going to be my final class setup for the AMX. Let's go ahead and test out how this controls. So I love the way this gun feels after adding all the attachments, but we'll go ahead and get into some gameplay. Oh, fucking what? Fuck you, bitch. Is that what that is? Yeah! 
Oh, I got like two more kills right there. <laughs> what the fuck? 57, 8 captures, 29 deaths. I think I'm gonna do better than that though. Alright guys, so I think that concludes today's video. If you made it this far in the video, I deeply appreciate you for sticking through the end. Like I said, this AMX class is pretty OP. Just to go over it again, we had the, the XRK Zodiac S440 barrel, the GI mini reflex, no stocks, live hand, and the Ranger 4 grip. Alright guys, Z Caliber here. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys later. Peace.